hey what's up all my friends and family thank you for watching my channel she's got the gift i appreciate your time um i'm truly grateful for you guys i'm honored thank you it's an honor to have y'all watch me okay you guys this message will be for my aries aries sun moon rising and venus hi baby boss what's up aries Every we finna tap into your energy and deliver you a next 72. So I'm finna give you what you got coming to you in the next 72, Aries. We finna figure it out and see what's going on. Before we jump into your reading, Aries, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for me, please. And thank you. Also, keep in mind, Aries, my messages are fluid, well, just as well as general. So when you're meant to click on it and see it, it's meant for you. Don't bypass it up. Just continue to click and watch and figure it out. Um, also, these messages are general. Aries, you already know that. Some things may or may not resonate for you, but it's okay. Continue to watch because there's something in here for you. Even if it's just one word, if it's for you, it's for you. So be it. Don't dwell on it. Take what resonates and leave the rest for someone else. Aries, with no further ado, let's jump into it. Spirit, white light, holy angels, please protect me as I channel these messages for the Aries. I'm asking you to give me utilizing, understanding, resonating messages for my Aries for the next 72 hours. Spirit, please and thank you. Aries. It's, I, it's coming to me. I'm getting a download. It's at the tip of my tongue. When it's ready to come out, I guess it'll come out for you. So during, at any given time during this reading, if I say something that don't got nothing to do with the cards, it's been downloaded, period, okay? Let's get into it. What you got for the Aries for the next 72 spirit? What's coming towards the Aries? What's going on? Again? All right. <laughs> Anything else, spirit? What else, spirit? Okay. Okay. Card down, you guys. Card down. Give me a second. Aries, it ain't an Aries reading if the cards don't fall. Mm, okay. Give me a little bit more, Spirit. Give me a little bit more before I put this puzzle together for the Aries, Spirit. What else? Okay. Mm. Overall energy is the Six of Swords and the High priest, Priestess. Listen to your intuition. You you walked away from someone, but someone wants to come back. Or you walked away from someone, and now you want to return, but there, someone is listening to their intuition about it. However the situation go, listen to your intuition. It ain't going to steer you wrong. Aries. You got the Queen of Wands here. You got the Chariot, Aries. You got the Star in Reverse. You got the Knight of Pentacles. You got the Six of Pentacles. You got the Hierophant. And you got the Two of Pentacles. Exactly what I said. You see, the you, Aries, are you, Cross Watcher. Aries, whoever it is that you're dealing with or whoever it is that you done walked away it was a whole period. They want to come back now. You are they wish fulfillment. But here's the thing. Whoever let, whoever go. Am I making sense, Aries, right now? Whoever let who whoever let who go, whoever let I don't know what the okay. Aries, whoever let whoever go. That just sound like it don't make sense to me. But anyways, um the person that let go that let go feel like they let go too quick, so they want to come in. But it, there is no longer a wish fulfillment. You know what role is you, Aries. You know if this is you, this person that's coming back is no longer wish fulfillment. Or you want to go back to someone else, but they feel like you're not their wish fulfillment no long, no more. Because you let it go on too. You let the situation linger too long. You guys distance you guys self from each other. And it caused someone else to go somewhere else and make an offer somewhere else. Um, With this Queen of Wands here, Aries, and the Chariot... The, the 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 loving was good the loving was good so this person that's coming back that's coming in pretty quick wants your loving wants that good thing that wine or that uh cookie yeah and this is your energy the queen of wands aries leo sagittarius so this person that's coming back and it could be a cancer that's coming back towards you or it could be a virgo too that's coming back towards you or you are going back to this person if the loving was too good for you just to completely walk away but um the situation unfolded like it was no equal give and take it's like 
let me just be straight up with you. It's like you was always pleasing this person, but this person was not reciprocating what you was putting out there to them, period, with the Six of Pentacles, okay? Aries, the overall situation is, you know, the matter of the fact is, they want a higher level of commitment now, or you want a higher level with this, this person now. It's like, dang, I let all of this time go past me, you know, or I let all of this, like, you know, feelings and, um emotions lead this person so now i want to run back with this chariot now they want to hurry up and rush back because they see you or they see someone else coming in with an offer honestly aries i think year 2022 for you is your year i think it's time for you to boss up don't look back and keep it pushing period um also i with this higher from being here aries i feel like uh the next 72 is gonna be you realizing that now i know who i am it's time for me to boss up. Just like I said, it's time for me to boss up and move on with my life. However, Aries, these next 72, you're going to feel like you got so much going on. You understand me? You feel like you're going to be juggling so much. But let me just tell you this. You could do it, Aries. You could do it. Don't don't think about um, if things are going to play out the way you want them to play out or if things is going to be on time slow and steady wins the race always aries period also with this knight of pentacles here and this six of pentacles you could be dealing with the uh taurus virgo capricorn but i feel like someone now is realizing that dang i should have or if this is you aries dang i should have gave this taurus virgo capricorn uh a try or it's like the person that you was downplaying and a person that you was putting on a pedestal the roles needed to be reversed you were supposed to put this taurus virgo capricorn on a pedestal and put this cancer where the cancer belonged because clearly someone was playing you in this whole situation with the star in reverse someone was getting played someone was dealing with multiple people with this queen of wands here and i'm strongly picking up this is your energy you was dealing with two three other people aries and the person that you did wrong was the person that you were supposed to you know oh my ear is on fire y'all it's confirmation mm -hmm. the person you did wrong you guys were supposed to build a legacy with each other with this uh ten of pentacles here with this judgment also with the hierophant it's a taurus virgo capricorn but all you guys did was fight and i feel like the only reason why you guys always fought and you guys always walked away from each other and turned y'all back on one another because somebody seen the good in someone and someone didn't even see the good in themselves. it's like um it's like um you played yourself basically aries that's just that you put you put a hole before the good one you left the good one at the bottom. You didn't acknowledge the good person, but that hole you had them right there. The hole knew exactly how to how to blow your whistle. Period. What's this six of pentacles? Is this six of pentacles? Aries? Is this the Aries doing that? Aries, you got out here. Um, cancer. You could be dealing with a cancer. You could be dealing with an Aquarius in the next 72 hours. You also could be dealing with a uh, Taurus Virgo Capricorn. And I also feel like Aries, you wanna you wanna um balance it out with this Taurus Taurus Virgo Capricorn. That's who left you, that's who walked away, and now you can't get this person off your mind. And now it's leaving you no choice but to come in and come in fast because you know this Taurus Virgo Capricorn is moving on. Clarify this six of pentacles. Mm. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take it. Okay. Clarify the six of pentacles for the Aries spirit. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Clarifying the six of pentacles, you got the three of cups in reverse, and you got the six of cups. Yeah, you want to go back to someone from your past. It was all fun and games when it would be with this uh three of cups in the upright. It was all fun and games. You was you was balancing everything out. You was juggling. You was running from house to house, giving good loving everywhere. And now it ain't no fun when the rabbit got the gun. Tables has turned. There's no more partying. There's no more third party situation. You don't want this. You done. You threw in the towel. You want to go back to the six of cups. You want to go back back to your lover the one you you know the one you could um accomplish things with the one you could you the one you could sit up late at night and talk to and they give you 
good advice. Look, and it's the Empress right here too, Aries. With the Five of Pentacles, you left this person out in the cold. You left this Taurus Virgo Capricorn out in the cold. Or this Taurus Virgo Capricorn left you out in the cold, Aries. But um, the overall energy is the next 72, somebody is going to be voicing their opinion. Someone wants to come back and say they sorry and plead their case to you. And they want a higher level of commitment. Also, you're going to know who the F you are. It's like you was, you've been sleeping on yourself. If it's you, Aries, or if it's you, Crosswatcher, someone noticed that they've been sleeping on themselves. And they have not been making themselves happy. They have been trying to hold up this facade and put this persona on and make everybody happy and everything is okay And I got this money and you know, let's go do this and have fun and party all the time party and it's over with And at the end of the day when you go home, you go home to no one at the end of the day You can't trust no one the one you were supposed to trust and the one that that gave you that good advice and that loved you and 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 embraced you And everything that came with you you did them wrong cross watcher or aries Whoever did whoever this is for, the person is coming back in the next 72 hours. Expect some communication from them. Expect some communication from them. What's this two of pentacles spirit? What's this two of pentacles spirit? Four of pentacles. High priestess and the six of ooh, and the six of swords. Clarifying this two of pentacles, you got the four of pentacles, the eighth, the, the high priestess, and the six, the six of swords. Aries, you have to let something go first in order to come towards this, uh, towards Virgo Capricorn. Or crop towards Virgo Capricorn, because I feel like Yaya is in here. If you're dealing with the Aries, it's something you have to let go first. You have to walk away from something first and listen to your intuition because spirit is telling you to leave something behind in order to come correct to this Aries. Or Aries, this could be you. Leave something behind in order to come correct towards this. Um, I feel like strongly it's a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. I'm sorry I keep saying it. But that's who. That's all the signs you have out here. You got Aquarius. You got Cancer standing there strong. Aquarius standing there strong. Taurus Virgo, Taurus Virgo Capricorn. You got a little bit of water here. Um, got the yeah. So you love this person who you going back to Aries, or this person love you who's coming back to you. Any last minute guidance for that Aries? Thank you. Any last minute guidance for the Aries? Thank you, Spirit. Mm -hmm. See, I told you. Uh, Aries, Spirit said in the next 72, no need to worry because you know who you are. It's time to step into your power. It's time to let that old shit go and let the new shit in and look for a sign. 2022 is your sign, Aries. I'm letting you know that now. One of your predictions is you're going to be an effing star, but you have to leave behind some people that you once deal with in order for you to succeed in life, Aries. And that's just that. All right, my Aries, that's what I have for you guys. If you guys like how I read, you guys like my how I get down, please continue to like, share, and subscribe. And for the ones that already subscribed, thank you guys for your time. I love y'all. Real talk. And until next time, Aries, have a good one. Bye, Aries.